birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Grandpa. Happy birthday to you. during the height of the Depression, and I graduated from OSU in 1933 with a Bachelor of Science degree in Pharmacy. The man that uh, I met in the barber shop who owned a pharmacy uh, needed uh, a replacement for his one of a better word a gopher and he paid me more than I was making so I decided to go to work for him and he convinced me that <coughs> pharmacy was a good profession. When I first started a going up there, the pharmacy school was in the basement of the chemistry chemistry building. And later on, before I graduated, they, they were able to move into the bacteriology uh, building, which was right across from the veterinary hospital. Oh yeah, Dean Dye, and he had the reputation of being able to identify crude drugs by odor or by sight. I, I'm going to guess at what uh, what he knew, but he he knew all of the uh, ones in the pharmacopoeia that were legal, you know. It's an honor to be sitting here reminiscing. I think I've forgotten more than I remember. But uh, the best thing I can tell you about the college up there and my volunteer work at the hospital has made me very appreciative of what the college does for young people going through who don't have a lot of experience. and. Uh, you just made a better person out of me, that's all I can tell you. Wow. Not that I was bad to begin with. <laughs> <laughs>
Bye. Bye. Yeah, it's my right there. Yeah, I told you. I wouldn't lie to you. Hey, Jack. 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 Hey,
remember like your last in the Were you surprised with this party? Words fail me too. He said words fail God bless you all. <laughs> Are you a Buckeye? Yeah. I think 1933 I graduated from the high school. You know this fella? Never seen him before. Well, well, you know what? Everybody tells me that and they're better off if they don't know that. <laughs> Well, so do you, you know, for being twice my age. Look at right now. <laughs>